Hi, I'm Elora Mann. I'm in seventh grade and I go to Brentwood Middle School. Uh, my favorite class would have to be math class. Uh, it's, I, I like how uh, my teacher, we do um, our math and then she ties it into real life so we understand how um, we can use it in the real life because a lot of kids go to math class and they're like, why do I need to know this if I'm not even going to have to do it in real life? But she shows us how to. I enjoy challenge because I think if I go, if I do things that are too easy, it's just like it, when you go back and you look at how you did, there's nothing really that you can do better. And when you, when you're doing something really easy, you're, you're not as proud of yourself when you do good. I'll go to school and know that today I want to make sure I have all my homework done or I need to go to school this morning, make sure I get this done for this class. So it just really depends on the day. It really is really easy to get distracted and not focus on your work, but it's easier to like what, that we're allowed to check our grades, that we know what we need to do. And if I have anything missing, I know I need to do that. And I have very supportive friends and family and teachers, so they help a lot. I think it's very important to have band and uh, and all of this is a part of my Brentwood experience because it also helps you like get ready for life and it builds a good like um, builds a good hobby, I guess, or a uh, habit to keep on doing these good things. And it's a lot easier to do this experience as a kid than it would be as an adult. Um, I definitely have learned a lot from my church camp and NJHS about people and I uh, have learned that it, uh, like I need to do better at teamwork and a lot of those things have just shown me how like um, blessed I am to have the school that I have and uh, I've also definitely taken like just what I've learned and how I've seen people and how I can be more helpful around school. You, in band you have to count the notes and you have to know when to rest and so in math, you learn how to count and all, and do all that. So I definitely think it ties together because you need to be right on the beat and all, and know how to when to play and when not to play. I am looking at Central, uh, more likely to go to high school because. They have the medical program, and I'm really interested in becoming a surgeon. So, and they have, and they have more AP classes. So, I was looking. I'm looking at uh, one of the big, so like Harvard Med or UCLA Med or Stanford, one of those. I think what excites me is just like the interaction you get to do with all that, and not every case is the same because we're all different. So every case is different, so it presents a challenge. I'm looking at uh, pediatric surgery or um, trauma surgery because I, I want to go do some um, uh, relief work in Zambia and Africa and stuff. I like Brentwood because the teachers are so kind and, and caring. Like, Usually when you go to school, you got teachers who will make small talk with you and help you for your school, but the teachers here at Brentwood are there to support you. I got teachers who gave me their numbers, and one of my teachers said, call, it, call me even if you're broke down the side of the road and need a ride home. And they're all just, they're not there just to support you in school, but they're there to support you outside of school. And they're great people to talk to if you need help. Uh, I think what makes Brentwood a family is we all care about each other. I mean, we do have kids who kind of are, but we always have those kids. So everybody just cares about each other, and we're and then our IFL kids they do a lot with us too. So we're just all caring, and we all like to work together, and we're always there for each other. I think I'll never forget just the caring atmosphere and 
Miss Ford and my uh, principals, just how important they were to where I would be in 10 or 15 years. And how I knew, you know, I wouldn't be there and I wouldn't definitely be here if it wasn't for them.